First, I am reading the target image. Now, I am writing this image in PNG format. Now, I am running the script. Code ran successfully, and boom! The image is converted into a PNG image. Wait, I have an idea. I'll use Pillow Library. Using Pillow, I can gain more control over image conversion. See? I've written only two lines of code. See? Now, let's build the web app real quick. Okay? I am creating this function that takes an image file and format. Then, it opens the image using the Pillow library, creates an in-memory space using Bytes I.O., and saves the image in it. Then it resets the file pointer to zero and returns the converted image. Great! Now, let's build the UI. I'm using Streamlit. It makes the job so easy. First, we imported the required dependencies. Then, we set up the page with a title and a description of app. Next, we add a widget for uploading the file where users can upload their images in different formats. When an image is uploaded, we'll display it on the page and show the original image format. Now, we'll give users the option to select a new format for conversion using a dropdown. Once a format is chosen, we convert the image using the function created before and allow the user to download the converted image with the click of a button. At last, we are adding a check that if the image format and output format are same, then the user needs to select a different format. Now, I'm opening the terminal and doing streamlit run script name.py. And boom, you can see the app. Now, let's upload an image. Wait a second, there's a mistake. Here, need to put a dot. All right, let's proceed to test the app again.